My name is Mike McIntyre. Um, I'm here today to uh, give my testimony. Uh, before I uh, accepted uh, Jesus, um, pretty much uh, I just I was kind of lost. Um, I just uh, I don't really want to say I was a non-believer, but uh, I just didn't really care. It just uh, wasn't a priority to me. You know, I looked at uh, Christians as uh, being weird. You know, I kind of always. Uh, viewed myself as, uh, you know, I, was, I thought of myself as a pretty good guy. I was like, you know, I, I'm not out here uh, killing anyone or, uh, or you know, committing, uh, I didn't think I was committing uh, a lot of sins. Definitely uh, played a part uh, on our marriage. Um, you know, Melanie, uh, she grew up in church. Um, she's been there. Um, you know, myself, I didn't grow up in church. Um, like, you know, I've never, I just never really thought about it. It was never a priority for me. Um, so, you know, uh, into our marriage, uh, I felt like uh, I just went to church just to support her. I didn't really go to church for myself. Um, you know, it was just I was just there for her, and uh, so I felt like a hypocrite. Well, I came here to Independence Hill um, about eight years ago, and uh, you know, I just, uh, I just met some really great people, and uh, just over time, uh, it just showed me that uh, you know. Christians aren't weird. Uh, you know, I became friends with uh, some of them, and uh, I just I realized, uh, you know, I want that in my life, and um, so, you know, it kind of it made me want to pick up the Bible and start reading the Bible, and um, you know, the more I started reading the Bible, uh, I guess uh, you know, the more God was uh, talking to me and um, just you know showing me that uh, He was real, and uh, just made me you know just start looking around at uh, things and. Uh, you know, I could go outside and just look at uh, God's uh, creations just around me. I was like, you know, there's there's no way that God's not real. I mean, He's around me every day. Just started looking at things uh, differently. One thing that uh, that I held back was because I just I couldn't understand everything. There's a lot of stories in the Bible. I mean, it just seemed unbelievable. And uh, unless you have uh, faith in Christ, you're not going to believe it. And I finally just kind of realized, uh, I was like, you know, I'm really not meant to understand everything. Uh, there's so much that's so bigger than what's here on earth, what you know, we see every day. You know, I need God. Everyone needs God. Uh, you may think that uh, you're a good person, but, uh, you know, we're not. And uh, we all need God. When I finally realized that, I was like, I was able to kind of let myself go. And uh, it's like, you know, hey, I'm ready. Uh, you know, God, take me. I just feel different. Um, yeah, you know, I have uh, I have a peace and a joy uh, w within myself that you know there's nothing nothing earthly that could make me feel this way. Um, I just have a different view on things. Uh, I treasure uh, I treasure people more. I treasure my relationships with people more. You know, before uh, Christ, I uh, I put my uh, faith in uh, material things, you know, earthly things, and uh, those are things that it just come and go. I mean, they're not going to always be here, but uh, faith in Christ is, it's, I mean, that's, that's true. That's, that's deep. And that's, 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 you know, that's why I'm here. I mean, that's uh, what it's all about. Well, I think, uh, you know, getting baptized, uh, I just kind of wanted to uh, just uh, cement the deal, uh, so to speak. Um, I want to thank my wife, uh, Melanie, just uh, for being there and just uh, having so much patience with me. And, uh, you know, just supporting me uh, through this journey. Uh, I know this is something that she's hoped for me uh, for uh, our whole marriage. And, uh, you know, it's just, I'm so thankful that, you know, we're able to uh, be uh, at this moment. And, uh, you know, I just want to thank, uh, thank God for bringing uh, Justin Hendershot in my life because uh, he was so supportive of me. Uh, and, he, and which, you know, he had a lot of patience with me too. and. Uh, just knew the right things to say, and uh, he was, and and you know Tim Groves, uh, you know, uh, just just hanging out with these guys, uh, you know, just just gave me a different view on uh, Christians. Uh, you know, these guys are uh, great Christians, but you know they were great friends too. Well, I'm here today uh, just to uh, just to share my testimony uh, with um, you know with whoever wants to listen. Uh, you know, I just want to share my testimony.